Okay, so I am starting this uh, quick run through. Five minutes, I think. So it's 11.59 now. Let's see how we go. Um, following the peak reviews, um, Rob said he would be interested for me to cast my eye over his site. So that's what I'm doing very quickly um, in a very brief nutshell. It's worth mentioning up front that this is not representative of the service that I offer on my site for website review. Um, it's probably a flavour of how I work and how I review websites, but this is a really brief overview um, of how I would do that. So I'm gonna follow the script that Peak follows and um, I haven't actually seen Rob's video so I've no idea what feedback he's been given so um, this is really just an experiment. I have actually no idea why I'm doing this but it just seemed like something fun to do. So here we go. So the question, first question number one, what is your first impression of this site and what is this site for? So um, obviously I have a little bit of inside um, information because I have um, had contact with Rob before. So my impression when I got here was I was expecting to see a web design website. So um, I really like the colours, really love the red, white and black. Um, I get the impression because it's very clean, lots of white space that this is somebody who really knows how to use the space available to them on a web page to best advantage. I really like the headline. Um, this speaks to me. I know that I would have customers that this um, would resonate with. So you're not a graphics designer branding with or WordPress ninja and you're stuck looking for help. Stop spinning your wheels. Book your free session with me now. So customer pain point immediately hit between the eyes with that. So telling their customer a bit more about the perfect match, which is really, really cool. I'm liking this a lot. Web design honors your work and some bits and pieces in the footer, latest blog posts, uh, posts, posts, um, giving back link, which is cool, and um, something from the dictionary of app tomorrow, a mystical land where 99% of all human productivity, motivation, and achievement is stored. I love that. So, okay, the next question is, what would I want to do next on this page? I'm just having a quick look um, down the side here. Kitchen of love, a culinary journey into the heart of devotional yoga. So um, I've got a feeling from what I have heard from Rob talking before that I, he is involved in this book in some way, I don't know how. If I was coming here for the first time, um, I wouldn't know that that was his book. So I would probably be presuming that was an advert to something. Um, it doesn't quite fit with m to my expectation of what I would have seen on the website. Um, but I'm sure it has a purpose as to why it's there. So, okay, what would I like to do next from here? Um, <clears throat> I really like that web design is in red because it really draws my eye to there. So initially, <clears throat> I want to click on this, but I really want to click on uh, work with me. And the title More of You intrigues me as well because I know that's in place of an about page. So I'm going to go ahead and click on web design just because I think if I was coming here for the first time, that's what I'd be really drawn to. Ah, and perhaps web design is red because that's where I was taken. So I'm going to click on home. Ah, home and web design, are they the same page? Interesting. Okay, that'll be why it's red then. So let's click on a different one. My internet connection is slowing up. Okay, so home and web design are the same page. That's um, clever thinking, but a little bit confusing for me from the navigation point, but I've worked around it. <laughs> um, so more of you, what exactly is personal branding? Okay, so cool. Um, having a quick read here. Love this signature. I think this looks really nice. The design's beautiful. Love the fonts. I'm really drawn into this. So you can get a free 30 minute call, or I can get 108% free guide to discover your passion. Um, so I can sign up for a PDF of some kind or I can book in for a 30 minute session. Um, that's cool. And then I can see down the side here more blog posts. And I'm not sure what this is. Uh, I like it. It looks nice. But I don't. I think it's um, for design rather than serving any purpose. So I'm going to have a quick look on work with me. Momentum is intriguing me as well. So work with me, a digital store, personal branding, complete online presence to get your message to the masses. I'm here to help. So again, it 
I'm loving this. I'm really, really clear because I know that my customers would be Rob's ideal customers, probably in exactly the same kind of audience that we might attract. Um, but this in, in the sidebar is slightly confusing me. Um, so love this fantastic step by step how it works, setting the expectation really clearly so that by the time they contact you, they've already got that whole trustability factor and they feel like they're quite keen to work with you. So get my schedule here. Cool, so they can drop you a message. Brilliant. Okay, I thought we were going to see um, a scheduler, a time scheduler, but that's cool. This is good, that works for me too. Um, and I seem to have a secondary navigation up here, which I hadn't noticed on the other pages. So I don't know if, oh, that's funny. That's the first time I've seen that. So if I click on about, is that going back to the same page? Oh, this is cool, interesting. Wow, so many options. So this is so cool. I could spend a really good amount of time. I've already spent more than five minutes, but I could spend a lot of time and I am going to spend more time looking around um, Rob's site. I really love the layout. I love the fonts and um, yeah, it's making me making me want to suck in and spend more time here. Um, so the last question on the peak uh, question, I was thinking about your overall experience. What did you like? What did you not like? Would you return in future and why? So I've been quite clear about the things that I liked. I've really enjoyed the experience of looking around Rob's site. I love the fonts, the layout, and the colour scheme. I think it, it really ties together beautifully. Um, it gives me confidence that um, I want a brand like that, perhaps, and that he would be the man who could give that to me. So that was really nice. In terms of what I didn't like, um, I was a little bit confused by the uh, sidebar element here. Um, but again, I know there's going to be a reason it's there, because the rest of the site feels quite trustable. Um, I know I'm, it doesn't put me off, it just kind of threw me off track for a little minute. Um, and this kind of dual red part, I thought it was kind, kind of clever navigation that this item was red because that's where you wanted people to go. Um, and I realised after some clicking that it was um, red because home and web design are the same thing. So that's cool. Um, I definitely want to spend some more time having a look around the site. Would I return in future? Absolutely, because this is somewhere I've in really enjoyed spending some time. I think there's some really uh, useful information for me to find here and I'd definitely be in, I, I like this, I feel like I like Rob and I'd want to hear more about what he has to say on things and um, almost to the point that I would want to find a way to work with him even if I don't need any of these things, I want to find what else he's got that I might want um, because I'm in, so it's cool, all good from me. So thank you for watching and um, I'd love to hear, I'm going to go and see if I can find a link to your peak um, review and see if anything I've said ties in. So thanks.